Job market is definitely going to impact students. Um, it's kind of interesting because this graduating class, when um, these students were admitted as freshmen, it was a wonderful market. And when they came through a week of welcome and all the, the advising, um, freshman and sophomore year, we were just talking about just all the incredible opportunities and it was such a great market at that time. So it, it really is disappointing as a career counselor to see you know what's happened to our students as the time has, has come along and this is a very difficult time to graduate. It might take a little bit longer. Um, it's it's good to start now. I, I don't know what else to, to tell students. I can't tell them, oh you should have started last month and I certainly don't say, oh well gosh let's wait till spring quarter. So my answer whenever you come in the door is, well let's get started now and let's come up with a strategy. Uh, it's not looking good. I'm going to a job fair tomorrow, but <laughs> well, I, it's going to be hard getting an internship and getting a job after I graduate. So. I think that the current job market isn't as big of a worry as we expect it, or as we think it is, and as the media is making it out to be. Um, it is if you don't have a job, but we're not in the Great Depression yet, so you know, there's, there's definitely a balance there. I'm in engineering and I think that's a field that in general there will pretty much always be jobs in. So I don't, I think it might hurt that I might not get as good a job as I would have, but I still think I'll be able to get a job. I'm a civil engineer and uh, I think that uh, the market for those kind of jobs is still pretty strong. People are going to need people to, uh, you know, still construct things no matter what state the economy is. We'll still keep expanding and building more freeways and bridges, so um, not really. I'm more concerned with just getting out of Poly first. Yeah. <laughs> really? I don't know. I want to go into healthcare, so there's pretty much always a job market for healthcare. Yeah, I want to go into lab research, and with the funding being cut, it makes me a little nervous about people possibly not getting jobs out because they're not getting grants. Yeah, that'd be something I think that I'd be interested in. No, that's not really something I've thought about. I thought about it back when I was not thinking of doing healthcare, <laughs> but I kind of already have my mind made up that that's the route I'm going. But they do like Doctors Without Borders and stuff, so I was thinking maybe if I don't get into school, then I could do that. I thought about the Peace Corps, but if I were to do it, I think I might do it maybe later in life when I've had a career for a little bit and I might want to try something new or feel like I have like a positive impact or something, you know, do something for the world.